Oh, we've got our ungodly concoction for today. Or should <laughs> I? Oh, wait, I forgot. I always forget to do it. The ungodly Ooh. concoction. Yeah, there it is. Wow, you guys have gotten so <laughs> Oh, we got so man. much stuff wow. going on. So for this one, I wanted to shout out Kit listening in Scotland. They posted about this a couple of weeks ago, and I think they found the sugar-free version of this in England, or in Scotland, I should say. Sorry. Sorry. Ooh, uh, awesome. Don't numbers. fuck me, though. Yeah, yeah. The numbers just went down. And I also wanted to shout out Scott in Florida, who found this at Big Lots and then offered to send it to me, and I was like, you know what? Let me cruise a big lots just to save you the postage and sure enough uh, at the big lots right next to the cleveland ohio airport i was able to lock down yeah, our gonna to go say, that far most, yeah most of those are closed here oh uh, yeah. yeah so uh, george go ahead and tell the people what we got <laughs> uh, got for them today we got a let's get ready to rumble energy <laughs> that's right let's get ready to Shit. <laughs> is this the officially licensed one? <laughs> yeah. Oh, he, yeah. Because he has that phrase. Oh, it uh, does. Oh, it says, yeah. it yeah. says right here, Let's Get Ready to Rumble is a registered trademark mm-hmm. of Ready to Rumble, Inc. Yep. yep. Used mm-hmm. under global license, not even local. <laughs> Which is, That's yeah, right. Michael Regal Buffers. Branch Management. Yep. Uh, so the website I found uh, says that there are over 130 places to get this drink. And it seems low. None of them are in the America. <laughs> they're all low. in England. Mm-hmm. Oh, they're just trying to be like, American sports, you guys love wrestling. Is I, that the concept? Well, I well, don't know. They like boxing over there. Yeah, oh, right? yeah, yeah. It's probably yeah because they got the they, they got the Tyson invented, Fury and stuff. They invented the the modern boxing hitting each other in the head. <laughs> yes, <laughs> the <laughs> Queensbury rules of the way the rounds are broken up and shit. I'm pretty sure. Uh, and then everyone else got better at it than them. The, uh, <laughs> the the website says the legendary voice of boxing presents the heavyweight champion of energy drinks. Right <laughs> this is from the website. And notice how many times they use this particular phrase. Our brand was built around a partnership with legendary announcer Michael Buffer, whose iconic catchphrase became the inspiration for our name and mission. With a strong partnership with Michael Buffer, our brand and design were crafted to embody the excitement and energy of his legendary announcements. Our close partnership with Michael Buffer brought a wealth of experience and celebrity stature to our brand. So they just keep hammering it's home. The Michael Buffer what's funny drink is that his name is not on here. It's <laughs> is on the it website. Not? Oh, it's got his, his picture. It's got really his picture. Yeah. But he's not named in print. <laughs> That's really strange. <laughs> <laughs> and also, uh, weirdly, that can says it's from Inglewood, New Jersey, but that it's a product yeah, of Poland. I was noticing that. <laughs> so, well, that's why it's in Europe C7B, everywhere. Inglewood, New Jersey, product yeah. of Poland. So this is... Uh, it comes here in a tanker, and then they yeah. <laughs> bottle it in New Jersey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. My favorite part about this is the Big Lots tag here. It says, compare. it's 99 cents, comparable yep. value, 248. Yeah, so that's right. We're getting a deal. <laughs> we're getting a big deal. A they, normal one of this is around two forty. They brought this all the way from <laughs> Poland, England, Jersey. Can you yeah. pass that this way? I yeah. See, I want to check uh, the expiration date. Oh oftentimes yeah. Times on these big lots. <laughs> big lots. Good plan. Yeah, they don't really go through. And no, actually, it's still good. It's technically, still good, right? it's good from twenty twenty three to twenty twenty five. All right, so we're hey, right in the middle. Yeah, it's, it's probably, aged yeah, beautifully. It's Thank aged you, Michael perfectly. Buffer. <laughs> all right. I'm ready to do it. Oh, so yeah, I won't yeah. keep us I'm up. excited about this partnership with Michael Buffer. Uh, yeah, we all are. <laughs> the I wonder where the, there's a big QR code. Where, I wonder where that goes. <laughs> Oh, it goes to the website. Oh, oh no. it looks like piss. Oh, it classic. looks like diseased piss. Are we are we looking <laughs> oh, at a classic. Red Bull ripoff? No. It looks like we're yeah. looking at a Red I Bull. I smell rip-off. it. It's a Red Bull ripoff. Uh. God damn it. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, man. Fuck off, Michael Look, Buffer. And it, looks, it looks like a ex, it looks like a pissy like steel reserve. If you <laughs> yeah, it's, like, doing it's, glass. Little, it's yeah. less yellow and a little more brown than a yeah. than your classic yeah, it's got Red Bull ripoff. Thank you. Smells like a Red Bull ripoff. Off. Yeah, it absolutely smells, yeah. smells like Red Bull. I'm already not oh, yeah, excited. It smells exa- or like Rockstar. It tastes it better than like Red Bull. Rockstar. It tastes better than Red Bull for Man, sure. It, it kind of smells like the bathroom at a big lots. <laughs> it's just like yeah, a they're all oh, yeah, this out this uh, piss and <laughs> urinal <laughs> cake. This they're is better than shit. Red Bull. This tastes like a Red Bull and a full throttle mixed together. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that I've had a full throttle. Actually, I have. We've had a full Shout throttle. Shout out. Yeah, Alexa sent me a, a full throttle hot off the presses Ooh. from uh, the Coca Cola uh, factory. Isn't there kind of a blue raspberry ring pop? There is. There kind of thing going is. on. <laughs> 
It's like a more complex Red Bull. I'm going to say yeah. that as a Somali. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Wow. It is a little the more technology complex. has advanced. The, I, it's not just a Red Bull ripoff. There's something else in there, and it doesn't have the extra hard bite that I hate Yeah, the, uh, OG yeah, yeah. Red Bull. Mm-hmm. You know how the hard seltzers used to just taste awful, and then some sort of advancement was made in the last like 10 years, and now they're, the I alcohol taste is drink, not so nearly as know. bad? <laughs> well, that kind of happened. The old ones, like when I was in college, the hard seltzers, were they still had that real gross like malt liquor yeah, back, oh, for sure. Background yeah, taste, yeah. and yeah, now they sure. don't. I feel like the same technological advancement <laughs> has happened with where Red Bull is still using the old tech. Yeah, and this is like a more refined. I, I don't find it as gross as Red Bull, but it's still that same taste yeah, that I hate. The same profile. It's just yeah, it's not as uh, it's not as intense as a Red Bull, but it's still. Not my fave. I'm giving that nothing. <laughs> That's a nothing? fucking nothing. Oh, nothing. No, you no. can't. You well, can't give it more than off. zero. No, we it's have... one to five. It's a knockoff. Okay, fine. Point seven six. Okay, for America. Well, for the what partnership rate, with Michael. Buffer. But what do you rate Red Bull? <laughs> Same. I, I said this before. That's my. That's the what lowest is... I go, except for uh, that update from last week. I but... try to tell people that I think the Red Bull is like kind of a two point five. It's yeah. kind of yeah, what I you would say. It's because of its popularity. Popularity, you have to base everything yes, off yeah. Red Bull. There's also there's some brutal ones out there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you've had a, that's some why very Red Bull gets a, you know, it's around, it's a medium range energy. Yeah, drink. yeah. There's I way worse ones. I think it's because it's compounded with the disappointment that comes when I crack mm-hmm. a can <laughs> and then I smell the Red Bull taste. I'm like, well, fuck, you didn't even try. It's like yeah. a disappointment, you know? I mean, yeah. yeah. To me, this is a three. Mm. Yeah, it's I not, would give it a three or four. It's better than a ra- regular. Yeah, it's better than I thought it would be. Yeah. Can I see the three. can? Sub one, not zero. Uh, there's a yeah. I mean, there's different. <laughs> if I'm rating this on like how interesting it is and how new, the, yeah, zero. <laughs> this is not anything new. This is exactly. Yeah, I could have a full throttler. This I probably wouldn't even notice. You're, you're really turning into Seth talking about movies. <laughs> so all of a sudden, this is not anything this new. Is nothing new. This is nothing We've been new here before. Seen. Yeah, retreading <laughs> the same ground. It's basically <laughs> just a Red Bull ripoff. We're using the same character. Yep. They threw Michael Buffer in there yeah, to fucking yeah. jazz it up. By the way, uh, Michael Michael Buffer got his famous catchphrase from Muhammad Ali, believe it or Wait, not. He didn't even what? come up with it? Yeah, so yeah, that seems wow. so he just took my, he just come, he came up, up with saying it long. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So Muhammad Ali's quote, he said, I'm so pretty, I'm ready to rumble. Rumble, young man, rumble. And uh, anyway, uh, hmm. Michael Buffer then trademarked <laughs> that phrase in 1992. And since 1992, what? he has amassed over $400 million dollars in licensing off of the phrase oh. are you ready to rumble white people stealing <laughs> black man's art straight up <laughs> yeah. holy wait, shit wait is it let's get ready or, or are you or ready? let's get ready okay. yeah well he added that's a right. let's get the ready. knockoff brand energy drink is are you I, ready? yeah yeah that's triple that's triple h's that, yeah. i actually am just thinking of the dx <laughs> thing are you ready Oh my yeah. God! Uh, That's so lame that you could just take a, a fun, cool quote someone said, and then just cherry pick a part you like and make millions yeah. of dollars. I just like it. that it's just Muhammad Ali, just off the cuff, can yeah, utter a four hundred million yeah, dollar phrase. Yeah. yeah, 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 exactly. Most of what he said was four hundred million dollar phrase. Yeah. To be fair, he does say it pretty fun. He does. I will oh, say yeah. He says oh yeah, it pretty fun. He does so he's really bringing a little something to the yeah. table, but yeah. Also, I found out uh, Bruce Buffer, who's the announcer for UFC, it's his half brother. God, mm-hmm. these Buffer wow. kids. They're all over the fucking well, and they were like estranged for many years, and then Bruce Buffer and Michael Buffer reconnected when they were adults, and then Bruce Buffer became his manager, and then that's how he kind of got into Where's announcing. Where's the A twenty four movie about yeah, that? Telling Fuck you, this Iron <laughs> Claw. Yeah, yeah. Shit, I worry about the Buffer uh, the Boys. Iron, the Iron Throat. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The Buffer Boys. Yeah, yeah. Falling out, what getting is, back this together. Is the half brother of a slogan. <laughs> it's time. <laughs> right? <laughs> For, yeah, that's yeah. bad. Yeah, that's, that's, not not a, that's not a phrase that was, any guy. I, I, would love if, <laughs> I would love if he was selling like alarm clocks and shit. Oh, it's time. Well, it's it's time. time. His, he's made his thing something else. It's that he wears a super flamboyant suit. Usually, like a suit jacket really? that's like iridescent or something. <laughs> okay. That looks like it's somewhat fancy, but also something no one would wear under any other circumstance. Yeah. Okay. And now his thing is, as he's saying the fighter's name, he starts wildly waving his hands in the air to exaggerate it, and then he ends it by fist bumping them. He so punctuates it with a fist. You're bump. saying he's all visual. Whoa. Yeah, he's <laughs> he, yeah. He's, yeah. The whole he's, he's become, really yeah. all voice. Buff- he's become more Fuck. of a performance. So cool, oh right? yeah, Buffer is pure composure. Yeah, yeah. I know Buffer 
remember mainly from uh, the fact that he was the uh, ring announcer for the main events of all the WCW shows from mm. probably late 80s through early 2000s. Mm, so that's he would, what you know him from. He would come out because <laughs> Hulk Hogan was almost always in the main event. So he was usually announcing for Hulk Hogan and he would always mm. have to come up with new shit to say about him. So by the end, he's just he going, did. you know, he is from Venice, California, known as Muscle Beach, and he's just stretching. Yes, it's anything. more a thing about Venice. Yeah, he's out of fair. shit. <laughs> yeah, not specific to Hulk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they have everything from A to Z in yeah, the yeah, USA. Z. That's right. Azusa, baby. Are you ready to go to <laughs> Azusa? Like <laughs> it's time would uh, actually make probably a better energy drink name. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's a, not as good of a slogan, but I think it's a better... It's God. time, specifically, five hours. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Five hour energy. I think <laughs> I think Michael Buck Buffer is credited or himself claims he is the one who came up with the concept that when there's a split decision, you should read the the deciding judges last. Oh, I thought they, you were going to say it should be up to the announcer. No, they didn't used to do that. They would announce the judges and they'd just be like, judge one says corner red wins. Judge two says corner uh, red wins. Judge three so says by corner the end, B you'd be wins. Like, we know. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> and so it created this like extra sense of drama. Mm. Okay. That seems pretty obvious, but it, it but it does now. <laughs> it's, yeah, it's wild that it took someone to be like, yeah. hey, maybe you don't reveal it first and just have us have to listen I, to all I this. I think sometimes <laughs> it's so obvious that it doesn't matter, but yeah. other times it's like, who, what the fuck? It's like a reality mm. show thing. <laughs> you know, you're Michael like, Buffer. I don't know what's about to happen. And it's more exciting the longer they make me mm-hmm. wait. Yep, yep. <laughs> well, shout out to Kit in Scotland. Shout out to Scott in Florida. Thank you for the recommendation. Uh, and, Scott uh, and Kitland. Oh, oh, yeah. Scott and Kitland. Kit in Scotland. What's up, y'all? Uh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. It was. Uh, it was uh, I think it's pretty good. Yeah, it's fine. It's, you know, it's, it's pretty, fine if you like Red Bull. Fine. It's pretty fine. Uh, that's a, for the value for 99 cents a big. <laughs> Nine cents. Here's the thing: if you like a full, thro- just get it. Yeah, yeah. It's there you be- go. It's you better as good it? as those ones. Did we get a number from you guys? Oh yeah. What are we saying out of out of five? Because you're not allowed to leave until you give us a number. Yeah, yeah. We need the number. <laughs> two, two and a half. I think okay. I'm gonna go five in the wow. in the grand scheme of things. Maybe four. I think wow. I'll go four. Wow. Oh, just, this, right. I'm going purely. That's, yeah, there's a lot of shit. Purely not about character. Plot or and just like <laughs> pure, what would I want to drink if I need caffeine? Wow, I think you're, I'm just going to yeah. four. You're a Red Bull guy, right? No, no, I only had because we had all those free ones. That's that's what I was thinking. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I got this, for, there's energy drinks that if I got for free, I would not drink them. Mine's Red Bull. Very few, but <laughs> really, like which ones? Do and this, you specifically oh, I don't even remember the name. There was this one that was uncarbonated. Oh, those are the worst. <laughs> it was so bad, and it was. <laughs> It was like three bucks, and I was like, why am I... And I got it, and I was like, oh, I've never had this one before. It was like ch- syrupy cherry. Was it 5150? No, this I've never seen it before or since. <laughs> that one was this developed... Was like I got in high school at like a random gas station. Uh, I was okay. like, oh, this one looks interesting. And then they rang it up, and they're like, that's 350. Oh, this yeah. like in 2006. <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah, they try to fail to enter the market all the time, these yeah. new companies. Yeah. And we're the only ones who ever really give <laughs> them the time them. of day. Yeah. <laughs> we, we probably give some of these drinks more press than they've given themselves. For sure. Yeah. Well, this one was carted off from a boat from Poland and dumped at yeah, Big Lots. Yeah, you think it would. I think all the ones that kind of taste this way probably come from Europe, though. Yeah. It seems like that's a, it, I think you're right about this that. This flavor profile seems big. Uh huh. Because they were they launched Red Bull the, over in Europe. It's true. Isn't it like Austrian. It's Austrian. Yeah, that's right. Uh, so they they borderline love this shit. Yeah, whatever this <laughs> taste profile they is, give they're this all to about babies it. over there. Bad. Been chopping trees. I done something new for this fight. Out of Rasa with an alligator. That's right. I have Rasa with an alligator. I done tussle with a whale. Out on handcuff lightning, throw thunder in jail. That's bad. Only last week, I murdered a rock, injured a stone, hospitalized a brick. I'm so mean, I make medicine sick. Bad dude. Bad. Fast. 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 Last night, I cut the light off in my bedroom, hit the switch, was in the bed before the room was dark. Incredible. Fast. Incredible. And you, George Fullman, all of you chumps are going to bow when I whoop him. All of you. I know you got him. I know you got him picked. But the man's in trouble. I'm going to show you how great I am. 